Alrighty, good morning. So I have, it's weird because I'm showing you this on screen, but this is not what I'm showing you. I just didn't want you to stare at the floor. So um, next, let's see here. Not next week, I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, for, no, Saturday the 4th is our next new releases. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm still recovering from that cough. Um, but I'm still printing labels, so they're not ready yet, but they'll be ready in time for Saturday. So hence why I have this here, so you're not just staring at the floor, but I wanted to read off um, some of the, well, all the new releases for the 4th. So first one will be birthday cake plus pistachio dream cake. And that was one that was supposed to go out this last week. And I was having issues with my labels and everything like that. So that would be going out for sure. And then another pistachio one, pistachio dream cake plus zucchini bread. And most of these, let's see here. Yeah, a lot of, yeah, a lot of them are the same. You'll, you'll kind of notice the pattern. And then we have um, French toast plus warm apples and peaches, which is sugar, maple syrup, cinnamon, vanilla, vanilla, apples, peaches, sourdough. And then we have blueberry cobbler and artisan bread. I do want to say I have a lot of this one. So I think there's like eight or 10 of them. Usually I only do like three or four just to kind of see, but for some reason I went crazy with this one. Um, so blueberry, sugar, vanilla, melted butter, bakery dough. And then we have balsam fir plus warm apples and peaches, which is pine, ozone, cedar, vanilla, apples, peaches, and then woodsy. Then we have bamboo and orchid plus crackling birch, which is musk, wood, floral, cedar wood, white birch, and bergamot. Um, then we have raspberry jam plus strawberry pound cake, which is strawberries, pound cake, vanilla, sugar, cherries, and raspberries. And then Aroma Spa plus Fresh Outdoors, which is ozone, mint, floral, sea moss, fresh rain, and musk. Clean Air, Driftwood, Clean Air, Cotton Blossom, and musk. Oh, another pistachio one. I didn't know I had this many pistachios. Pistachio Dream, oh no, 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 never mind. That was the zucchini bread. I forgot that I tested that first and then I don't know. I was messing around with some of the printer settings, so sorry about that. Fresh Outdoors plus Camp Outdoors, which is rain, sea moss, musk, woods, tonka bean, and oak moss. Then we have Winter, Cat Winter Candy Apple, which is a Bath and Body Works type, which is red apple, musk, rose, cinnamon, and maple. Raspberry Custard. Uh, oh, raspberry custard tart plus cornbread, which is raspberries, creamy custard, fresh bread, buttermilk, and cornbread. Raspberry jam plus strawberry pound cake. Do I have that again? Cold, mm, please. Hey, I feel like I already said that one. Oh, I did. Ha. Well, there we go. Okay, and then uh, Baja Cactus Blossom, which is a Bath and Body Works type, which is musk, woods, floral, citrus, and coconut. So, I think, um, so we'll have this new release on the 4th, and then I'm going to, next week, do some of the fun shapes, something besides the clams and the snap bars, um, but I'll show that next week. Um, most things are in clams compared to snap bars. I am probably going to sneak a couple like just single oil scents. Um, I like to have those in snap bars. So I'll probably throw in like a pumpkin caramel crunch and zucchini bread um, in the listings as well. But I'm not entirely sure. That's why I didn't want to put it in the video just in case. But I might. So um, otherwise I'll do that next week. But like I said, next week for sure we'll do... Um, the different shapes and I'll have a for sure price by next week 
because I still want to be an affordable shop and everything like that. But then, um, yeah, I don't know. I just, I have to figure it out because some of these clams, um, cause I switched clams to like a bigger clam. Like I think this is still some of the smaller ones. Um, and I didn't raise the prices obviously or anything like that, but, um, or even like the snap bars, um, I'm stopping these. I still have like a couple containers left of these, but I'm just going to do molds and they'll just be in the polypropylene bags. I don't know why that's so hard for me to say. Um, but now like realistically the clams, I think are like almost four ounces and we're only charging $3 and 25 cents, but that's a rough estimate. So like, cause oil weighs differently and stuff, but I think now they're at least like three and a half to four ounces. So we're still gonna leave them at 325 for as long as I can. And then the snap bars will still leave at $2. But um, the paw prints and the dominoes, I figure I'll just have those be in four to four and a half ounces. Um, I, you know, I'll try to do more of the four and a half side, but um, have those in little bags. And then the brittles, I don't know, I thought it was kind of clever to do like a broken bags of brittles because the brittles on their own are only like 3.5, 3.7 ounces. And I was like, well, that's silly because like a clam is about that, if not more. And then especially if we're doing between four and four and a half ounces of dominoes and paw prints, then yeah. Um, and then, yeah, the broken brittle bags, so triple B will be five to five and a half ounces. But like I said, that's not gonna happen until next week. So I don't wanna talk too much about it. But if you're expe or if you're wanting fun shapes, they're gonna come out next week. Um, I have everything like already pre-made. So um, if there's something that you really like, I would say get it this week or next week, um, or this week. <laughs> um, because I don't really have the same sense in the fun shapes. Um, some, uh, sometimes I do, but sometimes I don't because I was just kind of messing around and then I always had my paw print molds and I was like, well, we're called paw print melts. So like, I really wanted that to be the main focus, but then the clams were so much easier. So yeah. Anyways. Um, oh, there are, I think that's it. No, I, yeah, I think that's it. Um, yeah. Other than that, like, comment, and subscribe. I never say that because I just feel like I hope you like it, and then I hope you comment, and I hope you subscribe. But yes, please like, comment, and subscribe. Um, let me know, like, what you're looking forward to, and let me know if you have any sort of requests. Like, I have a bunch of oils that I just got, and I don't want to make too much right now just because, you know, we're still a new shop and everything, and I don't know what everyone likes. Like, I honestly don't like strawberry and raspberry I know that's like so silly in the wax world but like I don't like it <laughs> so um if, if you guys like it and you're gonna buy it by all means please let me know because it's hard for me to make those because I don't know they just like really upset my stomach um so if you have blueberry like the blueberry cobbler my dad loves it but um I just I can't smell it I don't like it <laughs> and it's my dad says it smells like how it should and everything I just like the berries I can't really do too much with berries um, or they have to be more subtle, but, um, yeah, let me know, you know, obviously I'm a big woodsy person and like cologne perfumey person, but, um, yeah, obviously if you guys are wanting something, suggest it. I'm starting to like zucchini bread and I'm starting to figure out that like really anything with zucchini bread is marvelous. Um, I have some Palo Santo and then like marshmallow fireside and stuff like that. Um, those will probably start to come out next week because I was like going through like a Palo Santo phase where like everything was I was mixing with that same thing with um, marshmallow fireside because I love smoky scents um, anything smoky to me is amazing I'm so surprised that like people are not jumping on like the pretzel train because I love everything salty like the pumpkin um, caramel crunch and then the pumpkin peanut brittle and then the pretzel I don't know how all that stuff is still in stock because like I'm gonna want it. I might just like steal all my stock and just melt all that in my room. But yeah, so anyways, um, small update. I wanna keep this video relatively short. So 
Um, sorry, like I said, that I didn't show you guys. I mean, literally, it's just labels. So that's what I was reading over here. And then, oh, two more things, I think. One more thing. Sweet strawberries plus zucchini bread, which is zucchini bread, vanilla, sugar, strawberries, and lemon. That's the one I'm waiting to print. So um, that will be going up too. As always, the pour dates are on there. The scent notes are on there. The pour dates, um, two weeks after what I have on here, you can melt. Um, I literally would say, you know, do wait the, the 14 days or 15 days, whatever. Um, but like I said, most of this stuff is like almost a month into curing, so you should be good. Um, yeah, other than that, uh, that's everything. All right, bye-bye.